What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Super happy to be able to record a video for you guys. I know it's been a hot minute um, that I haven't recorded a video for you guys related to beauty, but I'm super excited to be recording this video guys and I want to let you guys know that my videos related to beauty are not like stopping whatsoever. They are just going to be um, like like picked out videos like I'm not just gonna do a random makeup look I'm just gonna do something that you guys are really requesting and I really wanted to share with you guys um, I don't know if most of you know but my channel kind of went through a transition where I wanted to give you guys a little bit more um, family oriented lifestyle a little bit more of me and kind of stop trying to be someone that I'm not with the videos but I already talked about that so we're not gonna get into that but Happy to be recording a beauty tutorial for you guys because it doesn't mean that I don't like beauty. I love makeup. I still do it every single day. So in today's video, guys, we are going to be talking about the new um, Maybelline Superstay Foundation. Um, it's not quite new. It's been on the market for a couple of months, but it is new to me. Um, I've been testing this baby out for a couple of weeks now, and I am... I feel very confident on the information that I'm going to be sharing with you guys regarding this foundation and um, it's not going to be a first impression because like I said I've already used it so it's pretty much my thoughts my overall thoughts and a little bit of demonstration how it applies to my skin and give you guys like the whole like is it worth it type of thing so if you guys want to see my thoughts on this foundation let's keep watching so excuse my paleness <laughs> And I've been tanning. I don't know what happened. I think the lights are washing my tan off. But anyways, so let's go ahead and jump in the foundation. Um, if you guys know me, <coughs> I lose the top, the top to everything. So I have lost the cap. To the foundation <laughs> so let's just go ahead and start talking from the outside to the inside so this is the foundation this is what the foundation looks like this so this is what the bottle looks like it is a glass bottle as you can see is a glass bottle and you can see the foundation um, right off the bat I have to say that it is a it is a normal size of foundation that you will find at the drugstore. Um, comparing it to my L'Oreal, they're pretty much about the same size, as you can see. Um, it starts a little bit there, so it is a little bit like smaller than like these type of tubes, but it's kind of like the normal size to the um, drugstore foundation. The color that I'm currently using is the 120 Classic Ivory. Um, it is a little too light for me when it comes to tanning, but I think today will match good because like my tanning is fading away. So right off the bat, I have to say that when I opened it, when I got home and I opened it and I took the cap off and I saw that it had a pump, I was like, yes! I cannot stress enough how easy it is to apply a foundation to get the product out of the bottle when it's a pump. Um, I like the pump field. I don't like when it's glass. I do tell you why. I'm the type of person that I like to dig in and get every single last drop of the foundation. What I like about the glass thing is that you know you are going to be leaving a foundation stuck in the bottle and not have to, and not use every last drop of it because you cannot break into it. And I try um, opening this thing and it's kind of hard. So you can probably break it loose. Um, that's the only thing I don't like about glass bottles like this that I cannot get like every last drop of it because um, you're paying like $13 for um, a bottle so you want to get like the last drop of it but the um, high point to this is the pump the fact that it comes with a pump is like uh, it's like a must it's like yes you did it um, they do have they don't have a lot of range of colors um, when I was trying to pick they just have at least I think like 10 or so I would say well at least in the target I was they just had like a few so I didn't like that it didn't have a lot from the 120 to the 130 I kind of jumped a lot and I was like well either I am super pale or I am super dark like I didn't have an in-between and I was just kind of like bummed out about that um, the fact that it lasts all day, yes. I have to say that I wear it anywhere from like 9.30 in the morning and I just start taking off my makeup and take, take, having a, taking a shower like around 8.30, roughly 9 o'clock and I still have makeup on and my, my foundation still looks pretty, pretty good. I recently did a trip to the zoo and it was kind of warm outside 
and I was in, I was impressed to come back in the car about five hours later in the heat and see my foundation and my makeup was still intact no setting spray so the fact that it does last a very long time yes it does like I, pro I proved it in this Florida weather and I've worn it for more than 12 hours and it still looks amazing so the consistency of it is pretty pretty amazing it's not a thick foundation even though it's like full coverage foundation you think it's like really really like um like heavy and you're gonna feel like your face cakey or whatnot and I'm gonna tell you something it's very 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 lightweight it's a very good foundation um, it doesn't feel like you're wearing thick foundation whatsoever and I have to say that that is a plus especially here with Florida weather so I'm just gonna go ahead and prep my face really quick and I want to show you guys how it applies All right, so I just finished prepping my face and now we're gonna go ahead and start applying it. So, we are going to do a few pumps. Look at that. So we're just gonna do a few pumps. I'm talking about look how good that looks I don't know why yeah but I love how it looks let's try this side It looks so good. It's not even funny. Look at this side. Let me finish the top part. All right, guys. So really quick, I want you to see what it looks like without powder, without concealer, without nothing. It completely hides everything. It just looks perfectly flawless. Like, honestly speaking, guys, look at how it looks. Like, honestly, like, I am not afraid to come up really close to you guys and see everything because it hides everything <laughs> all right so what now what i'm going to do is i'm going to i'm going to go ahead and finish my face up and i'll come back to you guys once everything is done and we'll wrap it up
All right, guys, so this is the completed look. This is what I normally been wearing on an everyday basis. Ever since I got my lash extensions, I'm like, yes. My makeup has been super easy, super simple, and ready to be out the door in like 20 minutes or less. Yes, hunty. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're here to talk about the foundation. Um, honestly speaking, I have to say that it is an amazing foundation, guys. I am a... L'Oreal freak when it comes to foundations from the drugstore. Like, I love L'Oreal foundations. Uh, foundations. I love L'Oreal foundations. I've been using L'Oreal foundations forever, especially um, when the Pro Infallible came out. The matte and then the Pro Glow. They've just been one of my holy grail foundation from the drugstore. Um, so when I saw that Maybelline came out with this one, I was like, and I saw all the hype and whatnot. So I was like, all right, let me just give it a try. And I have to tell you guys, it's I am super excited that I've tried it. Um, my top drugstore foundation, like I said, are um, the L'Oreal Pro Glow, uh, the Infallible Pro, the Infallible foundations, and also from the drugstore, I've been loving the um, LA Girl Pro um, Pro Pro HD Pro Cover Concealer um, Pro Cover Foundation. It's been one of like my holy girls at the moment, also from the drugstore, and ever since I bought the Lori the Maybelline <laughs> Super Stay Foundation. It's the one I go to every single day back to back and I'm like, I am loving the formula. I'm loving the finish. It is a beautiful finish. I don't apply a lot of powder um, all over my face. All I like to do is apply a little bit of powder on the areas where I'm going to apply my, my powder con contour just so everything blends perfectly. But I love the finish. It's a super, super, super lightweight. Um, I don't feel like I have a ton of makeup. I do have worn other foundations in the past where I feel like I do have a lot of makeup on and I'm like, okay, this is not, this is not happening. But other than that, honestly speaking, this found, um, but anyways, this foundation is amazing, guys. Like, honestly speaking, I love this little thing. I f know that when I ran out, I'm going to go back and buy another bottle of this because I am truly obsessed with the finish. I'm truly obsessed with the coverage. I'm truly obsessed with the um the the long wear. Like the fact that it wears all day, and I don't have to worry about retouching my makeup or just having my the Florida um, heat melt my makeup off. It's a plus, guys. So you have nothing to lose. Um, it's quite. I will say it's not on the expensive side of the drugstore. It is what ranges from twelve. I think it's like twelve ninety nine at Target, but I'm pretty sure you can get a little bit cheaper at Walmart. I think I'm pretty sure. <laughs> um, or you can even go to Ulta and pick it up. And if you have points, you can use your points. <laughs> but um, yeah, guys, I highly recommend that if you're looking for a drugstore foundation that is going to give you amazing coverage, it's going to last you all day, and you're not gonna feel cakey about it or like cake like you have a lot of foundation or whatever. I highly, highly recommend you guys trying this foundation out. I'm loving it, and I'm pretty sure you guys will love it too. If you guys love full, if you guys love full coverage, then this is a foundation for you. So if you're a full coverage girl like me, because I love my full coverage, I don't need to be showing all my beautiful imperfections to everybody. Then I highly recommend you picking this baby out for um, right now. It is an amazing foundation, guys. I have nothing bad to say about the foundation. Um, just the fact that I thought they could have a little bit more of wide range of colors, but other than that, um, the product is amazing, guys. I honestly give it two thumbs up, honestly speaking. So there you go, guys. There's my thoughts on this foundation. I have been obsessed with it. I've been using it nonstop. I've been using it back to back, and I absolutely love the foundation. And uh, you should try it, honestly speaking, if you haven't. Go for it. You won't be disappointed. And if you are... <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> so anyways, guys, thank you so much for your love. Thank you guys so much for sticking till the end. Thank you guys for requesting this video. I love it when you guys request video. It makes my job a lot easier. Trust me. <laughs> so if you like the video, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. I'm not stopping doing video, guys. I am doing videos, but I had to take it a little bit slower because my health was just up the roof and I came to find out that it had 90% of it had to do with YouTube so I had to take it easy but the videos are coming guys and if you guys want to follow me on my Instagram it's Instagram right down here and yep so let's be friends thank you guys so much muchas besos I'll see you ladies on my following video adios